Gary Black just sold all of his Tesla position in the long short ETF. However, that's only in the fund where he can also short stocks. In the FFND fund, he still has Tesla stock and it remains his number 16 position. However, in the last few days, I saw Gary Black reiterate his $250 price target for Tesla stock multiple times. And here's him reiterating it one more time yesterday. I also wonder if Gary Black is selling Tesla stock in the managed accounts. At the end of last year, he had well over 100,000 shares he said so that's over 16 million dollars in today's stock market here's why gary black sold he agreed with this following post from james elon responding to this post by sawyer with the eye emoji followed by the robotaxi unveil announcement shortly after his tacit admission that the reuters article is mostly correct maybe not 100 correct because elon gave a vague they are lying with no details but the gist of things is this tesla will develop the platform that will be capable of building both vehicles but the consumer version with pedals and steering wheel etc will be deprioritized with talent and resources being focused on the robot taxi this can be viewed as bullish if one believes that tesla will solve autonomy in the near not too distant future why sell a mass market car if autonomy is sold? I can see that argument. Conversely, this can also be viewed as incredibly bearish if one does not believe that Tesla will solve full autonomy because it basically guarantees that the auto growth story is dead. Energy has a few good years ahead, but the long-term story here is also decreasing margin and value. Mexico keeps being delayed. There will be no high volume mass market vehicle for many years, probably 2027 plus semi has great potential but also years away from contributing 4680 has also great potential to transform the margin profile of the three and the y worth watching this closely as i have expressed in the past i view this approach as unnecessarily risky with this course of action tesla is worth very little or very very much it also depends on an individual's risk profile i consider myself conservative i used to have all my assets in tesla stock and i felt very comfortable today i view tesla as a super high risk high reward call option with a strike date expiring in six months or so all in on autonomy is a hill elon is willing to die on are you says james i think troy is closer to the truth than james i think the compact car is postponed for now not canceled they are prioritizing the robot taxi but they will still produce a compact car probably in 2028 or 2029 the reason is that there are no batteries for giga mexico because tesla's plan to partner with catl to build a cell factory in the u.s fell through the reason was not competition in China, as Reuters implied. Jim Sashley agrees and says this makes sense. Troy states that Tesla is copying what Ford is doing. Therefore, search for Ford's CATL cancel and you will find articles about Ford's new plan. The old plan was to partner with CATL to build a factory in the US and CATL would manufacture the cells. That plan is now canceled because they don't get the tax credit. The new plan is to license the technology from CATL and then Ford and Tesla will produce the cells themselves. They want to test this workaround to see if they can still get the tax credit. I think that explanation makes the most sense so far. But I have doubts about this logic. Look at the date, August 8, and you'll see why likely all these predictions are going to be in vain. I wasn't planning for all that rhyme, but the number eight is incredibly special in the Chinese culture. Phonetically, the number eight basically means wealth or prosperity, and they are obsessed with that number. And why would Tesla need to get battery credits in China for the vehicles made for China? Hmm? So why wouldn't Tesla build a compact vehicle in China as soon as possible from this moment unless tesla really need all of that extra engineering talent to work on the robot taxi but tesla has a whole engineering department in china they re-engineer the model 3 couldn't they just make a whole new vehicle so my guess is that announcement will have something to do with china too it would be too weird for it not to have anything to do with China. I will consider myself tricked if there's zero things about China during that announcement date. Now, it may not necessarily be a new vehicle announcement for China specifically, but there should be at least something significant specifically for China. I think any 
Chinese Tesla employee is going to look at the data and say, oh, it's about us. Something is about us here. Now, the absolutely worst day to pick for anything, if you want to impress the Chinese, would have been April 4th in 2024 because the number four is considered extremely unfavorably in China because it sounds like dying. So imagine going to an elevator and pressing die <laughs> and then you go to the floor number four.